Hi all, welcome back to Easy School Works. In the previous video, we have already learnt about whole numbers. If you want to watch that video, please click the link given in the description box. In this video, we are going to learn about operations on whole numbers. So, let's get started. We can perform addition, subtraction, multiplication and division on whole numbers. First, we start with addition. Let us see how to add two numbers by using number line. When we want to add two numbers by using number line, we have to move right side on the number line. Let us see with the example. Here we have to add 3 and 5. What is the first number here? 3, right? So we have to start at 3. What is the second number? 5. So we have to move 5 steps right side on the number line. See. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So the answer is 8. Okay. Now let us add 6 and 4 by using number line. What is the first number here? 6. So we have to start at 6 on the number line. Where is 6? It is here. What is the second number? 4. So we have to move 4 steps right side on the number line. 1, 2, 3, 4. So the answer is 10. Okay. Now let us move to subtraction. When we want to subtract one number from another number by using number line, we have to move left side on the number line. Okay. Let us see with the example. Here we have 6 minus 2. What is the first number here? 6. So we have to start at 6. What is the second number? 2, right? So, we have to move 2 steps left side on the number line. See. 1, 2. So, the answer is 4. Okay. Now, let us go to another one. 8 minus 5. What is the first number here? 8. So, we have to start at 8. Where is 8 on the number line? Here it is. What is the second number? 5. So we have to move 5 steps left side on the number line. See. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So the answer is 3. Now let us see how to multiply two numbers by using number line. Multiplication means repeated addition, right? So we have to move right side on the number line. But where we have to start? We have to start at 0 and move towards right side. Let us see with the example. 4 into 2 means that 4 times 2. So we have to make 4 jumps of 2 units. Let us see how. First we have to start at 0. Now let us make first jump of 2 units. 1, 2. So jump from here to here. Second jump of 2 units. 1, 2. So jump from here to here. Third jump of 2 units. 1, 2. So jump from here to here. Fourth jump of 2 units. 1, 2. So jump from here to here. So what is the answer? 8. Okay. Now let us go to B with 3 into 4 means that 3 times 4. So we have to start at 0 and we have to make 3 jumps of 4 units. Okay. First we have to start at 0 and we have to make 3 jumps of 4 units. 1, 2, 3, 4. Jump from here to here. This is first jump and second jump of 4 units and third jump of 4 units. So the answer is 12. 
Now let us see division by using number line. Division means repeated subtraction, right? So we have to move left side on the number line. We have to move left side till we reach 0. Let us see with the example. First one is 12 divided by 3. First start at 12 and jump 3 units left side. See 1, 2, 3. So jump from here to here. And keep on jumping 3 units left side till we reach 0. Again 1, 2, 3. So jump from here to here. Again 3 units. 1, 2, 3. So jump from here to here. Again 1, 2, 3. So jump from here to here. See here we reach 0. Now let us count how many jumps we made. First jump, second jump, third jump, fourth jump. 4 jumps we made. Right? So the answer is 4. Let us go to B bit. 10 divided by 2. So we have to start at 10. And jump 2 units left side on the number line. See. 1, 2. Keep on jumping 2 units left side till we reach 0. 1, 2. So jump from here to here. Again 1, 2. From here to here. Again 1, 2. From here to here. 1, 2. So, from here to here. Now, let us count how many jumps we made. First jump, second jump, third jump, fourth jump and fifth jump. So, 5 jumps we made. Now, the answer is 5. Okay. I hope this video is very helpful to you. If you like my video, please like, share and subscribe. And don't forget to click on the bell icon. Thank you.